This is a walkthrough video of 6157 Midnight Pass. We're here in Bay Oaks, and this is unit E02. Um, just get off the elevator and um, turn right. Bay Oaks is a community here on Siesta Key on the Bay side. This is a second floor unit, it's two bedroom. It's two bedroom, two bath, and it's um, 1,100 square feet. I'm gonna start over here. Basically, I walk into the big open living space, which has a balcony. Not much of a view from the E building. There's a few buildings on here that do look overlook the, um, the bay. The kitchen has been updated. Um, you know, there's no plastic stuff on the ceiling. Uh, these are actually really nice granite countertops. I have to say, it's a really pretty granite. Um, back, backsplash, you could use a little tile backsplash to update it. The cabinets are okay, white appliances, um, tiled bar here. And here you have your washer and dryer, which is nice. This unit rents for $1,400 a week in season, probably a little less out of season. And um, you probably can expect 30, over 30 weeks rented here. Uh, furnished, pretty mediocre furniture. I mean, it's, it's, it's fine. It's fine for a rental. That, that couch is pretty hideous, but it's, uh, it's fine. So this is what the balcony looks like, and it is quiet out here. There's a lot of um, well, bay oaks, there's beautiful oak trees, as you would expect. And... Um, this is nice, this is the owner's closet, so if you have it in a rental, you can store a lot of stuff in here. And this is a big closet, so, um, you know, a lot of these owner's closets are just that, a little closet. This is actually a big storage room, which is nice. Bay Oaks has a HOA fee of about $1,300 a quarter, or, We'll say, I don't know, four thousand dollars a year. Taxes here are going to be about three thousand um, dollars. So that's about nine thousand dollars in expenses between HOA fees and taxes. Um, then you got some utilities and maintenance. So call it the cost of ownership of about ten grand if you put it in a rental. Uh, they do have on-site management here. It's a little closet. Actually, it's a big closet. And it walks through, which is cool. I didn't realize that. Walks through to the bathroom. So this can either be the guest bathroom or the bathroom to the suite. So um, that's a nice uh, quartz top on there. Let's take a quick peek in here. A little shower. Just white tile. All fine. Then this would be the master bedroom. This has a view, uh, again, not much of a view. We, we're looking uh, across the parking lot. There's some tennis courts over there, nice oak trees, but it's, it's very private. Big room here. I'd say this is uh, 15 by 12, so it's a good size. And again, a uh, nice granite top on, on dual sink. The shower has been nicely redone with um, you know, a nice tile. Actually, it's really nice, I gotta say. Like the shower door, I like everything about this bathroom. It's a nice shower. And then the master closet's really big. Um, it's a good size master in here. And this, I assume, is going to be more closet. Huh? I thought it was the air handler. Did not see the air handler. Let's take one quick peek for the air handler. You can hear it. And this would be a linen closet. That would be a coat closet. This must be the air handler right here. Oh. Hmm. A little game I like to play called Hide the Air Handler. Water heater, 2011. Um, this looks like this was done in 2015, so the AC water heater in good shape. Uh, it's nice because it has a humidistat. This is a nice feature because when you're away, you don't have to um, cool it. You only have to turn the air conditioning on when the humidity goes up. So that's it for unit E02 here in Bay Oaks. I'm Jules Roman with Yorkshire International, 941-366-0000. This property is listed by Michael Saunders, and I thanks for watching. Bye.